What is going on, everybody? This is Strike. Welcome back here to Assassin's Creed Valhalla, episode number 17. I got over here to the gallows tree and it said that I could interact. It also said that this is his wife's grave. Flowers from Jarl. Now to meet Bjorn beneath the gallows tree. Isn't this the gallows tree? Yoink, 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 yoink. Oh, he's over here. I was like, where the hell is he at? I brought her here. Yeah, I had her last battle. Where it began. Where it ends. I understand. They hung my wife in this tree and buried her among its roots. A grim and undeserved fate. We took Njal in as a cub. She and I. No children of our own. Hey, honey, we don't have kids. Can we have a bear? Yet I remain. Join our clan, bud. Dear Njol, you were always at my side for the better years of my life. I must have ended like this. It's ended with vengeance. Njol sleeps at the old father's feet tonight. Yes. They let loyal hounds into the Hall of the Brave. So Njal too is there. Even though Njal's a bear, she gonna be there. With Elfhilda. Well, maybe that's some closure for him. Viking funeral. Why is, why is that shield see-through? <laughs> and now it's not. Alright, well. Damn. Y'all took up like a... Like a... Like a... Like kindling. Real quick, real fast. Before, you asked if I would join your clan. I am ready. Sweet. Good. There'll be a place for you on my longship and in my clan. I shall sing of Alfilda and Njal during our travels. Sing of their deeds. And I will carry their names into battle. Good plan. When I you're like ready, it. follow the river Nen to my settlement. We shall welcome you as a brother. I will be the berserker of the Raven clan. Hell yeah, buddy. All right, so we are able to recruit some that are out in the world. All right, let's see skills. We have skill points, apparently. We've got two skill points, and that gets me to the perfect attack, which is fantastic. And I don't really know what I want to work towards at this point. Poison build up poison damage. I don't even have poison like weapons. Do they have to have poison weapons? I don't know. I guess we'll just buy that and see if if we actually need some kind of poison weapon in order to use it. Uh, I meant to click the quest tab. So we can just report to Ranvi, and that's out in our settlement anyway. So we're all headed in the same direction for everything. But yeah, so that's one whole area completed now over here. Another whole area completed over here, and three whole areas completed, and then this one is a little under 50%, probably about 40% or so. So that's not too bad. You know, working through it best I can. And while we're here at the settlement, I guess I can go through and clean up some loose ends here and there. And I know that there's a bunch of contracts and stuff you can do for Opal and everything like that, but I didn't do any of that. I was just going around getting the objectives done in the land first. Then I can always go back through and do the uh, the contracts later because I should talk to hide them. That's one of the uh, the quests for this area is to do some stuff. Okay, I already spent the skill points. So that doesn't matter. I don't need to talk to you. All right, let's go to right here. This should be the legendary animal place. You and Petra chasing a white elf in the woods high as wispy clouds, my god! I could barely breathe for laughing. 
Beautiful, beautiful. Nature is amazing. Making fun of us, little bitch. All right, so there we go. There's another one. Hollowed monolith. Very nice. Okay, so I found three of them. I killed the elk. I have killed the black shuck. I didn't kill these guys because they're like power level, <coughs> power level sneeze. So they were too difficult for me. For you. We do. I would like to see what you have in stock. What was the done for now? What was the reward? I brought something for you. What am I bringing? Oh yeah, that's right. I can get. For this. I can get runes and stuff like that. I forgot about that. Well, I forgot about all of them, so it doesn't really matter anymore. I guess. I could really use this. That's, that's, some of this stuff looks kind of easy. It just looks kind of grindy. I do, for the most I think that means that I have these, yeah. Damn, you can get a whole bundle of that, well but I don't have wolf, enough wolf fangs. I need five. I've only got three. Okay, so that's pretty cool. Nothing else? Uh, no. I have to... Say that's hi it. to Petra if you see her. Uh, yeah, she's around back. She's right there, but I don't... I don't care. Also, I'm gonna kill this stupid fucking kid. Because that's the kid that wants me to follow. Now, I'm curious, because I do have a scheme, just to look at it, so you can see for yourself if you're playing the game. You can change your tree and stuff, and I think this gallows tree is one of the new ones I got, which should be like the one that we saw before, yeah, with the hanging skeletons and stuff. I was rocking this this white and red one, and then there's Hanging's tree, which is just like a bunch of black fabric and stuff in it, and then there's a mossy tree, which is just uh, covered in moss, but I like the red one. I think it's fancier. And then there's other little minor areas where you can put visual elements, like right here. I put in the red dragon thing over here. And I've got a bunch of stuff that I can put over here. But I don't really care to. Okay, but anyways, we're gonna go ahead and go to, to Randvi. We can get that done, and then we can figure out the other quests and stuff that we're gonna do. I could bring the bell and we can do... Good day, Eivor! We are peace. allied with the Danes of Grandabridshire. Their Jalskona, Soma, has pledged an oath. Well done, Eivor. These early victories will pay off well. Mm -hmm. They will, in more than one way. One of Soma's finest fighters, Birna, has pledged her blade to us. Mm -hmm. She's a powerful fighter and a charming spirit. I think she'll fit in nicely. Glad to have her. Good work. Thanks, Doc. And... Okay. Okay. Okay, cool. So Birna does officially join our clan. At one time, the title Jarl referred to a man second only to the king, but that use has softened. Now a Jarl may be a chief, a leader, or a man with broad wealth and influence. The world is bigger now, and broken into many pieces. It seems our language must do the same to keep up. <laughs> An interesting thought. Chailbert, your father sent you here to learn, not teach. Then Daddy. you must start, Eivor. Give us a summary of our recent gains, for instance. The clan is thirsty for knowledge. You want me to give a speech? Right. Sup, bitches, we did it. Yeah! That would pretty much be it. My friends, hearken to me, and hear a tale of triumph and toil. I have traveled far since we landed, and seen much on the roads and fields of this new England. And for all my travels, strong alliances have we gained. The Honorable Cheowulf, King of Mercia, now calls us friend. And to the south, Soma Yalskona and the Danes of Grandabridge have pledged their oaths to us. By Sigurd's hand and my own, we have strengthened the ties of- You seat yourself as Sigurd's equal in these tales of yours. Would Sigurd do the same if he were here? I'm a kill dag. Sigurd knows what I have achieved, and he would celebrate it more roundly than I have. But this takes nothing from you, all of you. For I sit among some of the staunchest wills and strongest fighters I have ever known. 
And so I raise my horn. First to Sigurd. May he return to us soon. And to the Raven Clan. The best of friends and fighters. To Sigurd! I really to like Sigurd. Dag. May he return and relieve us of you. I really like Dag initially, but he's starting to piss me off the a lot. Ale as much as Dag has. Skull! Skull! Can I at least fist fight him? Or would it soften my blows if I was? Your words are blunt enough, but it would explain your boldness. My eyes are clear and open, and I see before me one eager to claim a piece of Sigurd's glory. There is enough glory in the world to go around for all who earn it, and I have no doubt how much I am owed. Just as I thought, you're... Attackers from the river! They look to be Danes! Danes? How many? Too many. Now come, the battle roars already. Bloody curse! What quarrel have Danes with us? Those who can fight, take up your weapons. All others, stay here! Fuck this dad guy, for real. With me! Let's go fight some Danes. Since apparently that's what we're doing now. <laughs> And because I sneezed, now my nose is running, so I apologize. Love black screens. Really interactive. There is nothing for you here but death! Okay, now we go. Now we go. Raw materials 100. That. That is good. Because I can actually do a bunch of uh, new fights over here. Oh, he did. Ooh, I dodged out underneath that. Well, I'm glad you're enjoying it. What? Oh, they lit our shit on fire too? Come on, man. Yeah, Why does it look like your drunk uncle at a party? He can't even get a word in my house. Look at that. He gotta clean the fuck up. Look at this. They lit all our shit on fire, man. Man, they lit our blacksmith on fire. Another oh. or, I guess skull crusher. It's the same thing, it's just he's got two axes instead of knives. And I hate fighting. Them. No idea where Abor was going, but I figured I'd let her do her thing. And I lit myself on fire. That's a fun event. Really great, but it's fun. You have seen nothing of our strength. Only a few cowards left. Oh, sorry, those are my guys. My bad. Come here, bitches. Ooh. Are you are you saying that to us? Because we're kicking your ass. Well, your gods are shit because we're kicking your ass. Anybody else want to get a sword in here, or are you guys just going to stand there and watch? Oh, shit. Any stamina? I tried to dodge twice, but... Way to miss it, idiot. Who is screaming over there, for real? Thanks for joining in, damn. Is that hype? I can't even tell. Woo! Get that, bitch. You will meet only death there. Ooh. I just punched homie's head off. Got him. Just missing. 
Is that half a leg? Is that the last of them? The rivers are clear. If more were coming, they thought better of it. Good idea. By their colors and markings, I believe they come from Geatland. But with none left alive to spill their secrets, we may never know why. Here is one. <clears throat> this vermin was crawling to the river, hoping to float away. I was suspicious that it was Dad that found him. Have mercy, friend. And you may find an ally with us. Mercy is earned by the quickness of your tongue. Where do you come from and what is your quarrel with us? We are settled in East Anglia. Newly arrived and hungry for silver. You drifted off course. This is Mercia. As we were ordered. By whom I'm gonna kick their ass. By whom? You bore me. Useless hound, scratching your ass in search of silver. Put an end to this one. Your silence earns you no kindness, Geet. So I'll ask you once more. Who sent you? The wind sent us. And the rivers will take us home. He begs for death, Eivor. Give it to him. Or send him home with a warning. Let him tell his people what death awaits them, should they sail this way again. Mm -hmm. I want to kill him, but Ranby's right. Go, and do not return. Ugh. I thank you. This is not mercy, it is death deferred. Should have taken a couple Whoever sent you warned them of the slaughter that awaits, should any return. Oh, what tales I will tell. Send one of your scouts to follow him. We will find... Never mind. This fucking guy. To show mercy would endanger us. Soil our reputation as cowards. This was the only end possible. We could have learned something by tracking him. Now we know nothing. Sigurd would have acted as I did. That is all the justification I need. Sigurd is not here to make such Why a call. Why is such but a I am. And if you cross me again, he will know about it. I see you, Eivor. And I know what you are. Yeah, I see you too, and I know what you are. Put no stock in what Dag says. His bluster may be loud, but it blows softly. Yeah, but he's pissing me up. off, man. And we'll talk of next steps. It's a real nice longhouse we got, though, to be honest. Come. I was already gonna head over to the mailbox anyways. I did. Put them right over there. Keep them out of your way when you aren't using them. I didn't really read it. Oh, so it looks like there's even further expansions. Huh. Okay. Well, we're a burrow now. So that's cool. We can do cattle, grain, fowl. We can do all kinds of stuff. See, look. Look. Do you see that? A little problem. Follow Nud. That shit's back up on my screen again. I don't know why it keeps doing that. I'm so tired of seeing it, though. Like, for real. I'm so tired of that popping up in the middle of everything. I do see that there's an exclamation mark. Is someone knocked out over here? Do I need Where to help are you? They? Yeah, all right. We gotcha. Okay. Uh... Soon. Right, I can do the, the farm over there. Damn, this is the last step. It's all expensive. I think what I want to do, actually, if it's possible, since everything's on fucking fire now, see if we can build this fish place. I don't know what what good it's it'll do, but why not, right? <laughs> it built it as if it were on fire, too. <laughs> 10 out of 10. Thanks for the good work, Eivor. Got a real little fishery going here. Mm -hmm. Are you the man in charge? 
It's my grandfather, really. But he says the best way to learn responsibility is by working. Besides, between you and me, I'm better at it. More of a people person, you know? <laughs> I do. It's good to have you. Both of you. I have something that may interest you. Oh, so we can get more stuff. Okay. I was curious why some of these buildings were going to exist and what they'd be for, you know. We've been looking for this fish for a long time. I can find a lot of these because uh, through the shop, I have to go. Apparently, I can I'll see fish you later, now. friend. So that's kind of cool. Come Instead of me having to use a bow, um, but I got these thingies, not that. Uh, these thingies, the the fantastic fish and where to find them, where you can actually figure out where they're all at. So that's pretty easy. I don't, I don't know how to fish. I'm sure we'll figure that out later, but until then, it's whatever. All right, let's go talk to Hytham, since this is now something that we can do here. I don't know why she wouldn't go to the door, but... Good to see you. Um, Eivor, again, your people impress me with your skill. The invaders barely stood a chance. We're pretty good at fighting. Keep this. It serves your cause better than it does my pocket. Ah, good. I hope this one did not give you too much trouble. As a token of my gratitude, I want you to have this. Keep this up, and the land will be free of these monsters. Oh. I have to go. Then go in peace. Okay, so you can get abilities from doing some of these collections as well. Oh, this got upgraded, by the way. All right, so what is this? Ranged Poison Strike applies a poisonous concoction to the tip of your arrow. Poison Strike applies a poisonous concoction to your right hand melee weapon. Poison enemies suffer additional damage over time. All right, I'm gonna put these on. I don't really like that ax throwing thing. It's kind of cool, but I don't, I don't really like it. And then this one, I can get rid of that one. The harpoon, because the harpoon, I just didn't really like it, to be honest. But this this got upgraded, so now you can see there's another section that says upgrade underneath, because I found another book of knowledge for it. But yeah, that's cool. There's some of these abilities that you can do over time, and that is nifty. Okay, so now let's go speak to Randvi and see if uh, we've got any more information from where Sigurd went, and if I can somehow help in any way. We just did a feast, technically, so I'm not too worried about doing that. Eventually, one of these days, I'll probably get that. Because I know it does give you some kind of time to buff. Good day. I want to see the Alliance map. Ah, okay, so it did open up some new places. So this is where Sigurd went. These areas down here are higher in terms of, of the thing, because it's 90 and 90 here. Um... So that's cool. That upgrades our settlement level, which would be nice. What does this do? Same thing over here. Now, I'm going to go ahead and Dane say invaders. East Angla is East Anglia. worth it. Is that right? Yes. Dane invaders who serve a man called Ruid. He seems to be sowing discord among Saxons and friendly Danes alike. Years okay. ago, the sons of Ragnar hoped to pacify the land. They appointed a steward named Finnir to find a suitable Saxon king. But the kingdom has fallen into ruins since, with no king and violent raiders ravaging what little peace remains. Can confirm. I suggest you make for East Anglia and find out what their steward is doing wrong. Okay, we're gonna do that because this region is already completed, so I can work on the other two regions off camera and stuff. I'll I'm make recording a bunch of videos. Then. Speak to this Finier myself. Because I'm gonna be busy for a couple of days with the holidays and stuff, so I'm I'm probably not gonna have a whole lot of time to do things off camera, but that's okay too. So it'll give me something to jump back into to kind of get the swing of things. Now, we're already tracking that, and I think that harbor is going to be a faster, fast travel. I've already found titanium, so that's not too hard to get. Yeah, some mushrooms are fucked. Alright, anyways, 
moving onwards, we need to go confront the Dame Steward and see why. Also, I don't know why these pop up, but sometimes these pop up and they get stuck on your, your whatever, your view, until you restart the game, basically. But, let's see what's happening over here. Happening. Finier? Oh, no, not unless Halfton sent you. Whoever you are, I want to know why there's no king on East Anglia's throne. Because the man in question ain't been married yet. Once he is, East Anglia will have its king and little else. Which man? <sighs> You know, stranger, you interrupted a beautiful dream. I was sailing through Helheim, drifting on a ship of fire. Dreams of, fire? of death like often run ahead of fire? the real thing. Oh, <laughs> wouldn't that be a burden off my shoulders? What business that have one. you with the backwater king, anyway? Danes from here attacked my clan. I want to know why and how to make sure it never happens again. Ah, that would be Ruid's clan. They killed the last man I put here, Adelstan. I suspect they'll do the same to our next monarch. A Dane who cannot keep the Danes in line? Not much of a steward, are you? If I knew how, I'd have rid our lands of them long ago. Ruid's clan plagues us all, Dane and Saxon alike. You are the sorriest soldier I've met in this country. Kick your king in the arse and fight back. He needs more than a kicking. He's got nothing he should have to win this fight. No courage, no army, no charisma. If he wants to live longer than a season, he'll need the backing of his bride's family, which he hasn't. They loathe the maggot. Who is he, your king maggot? Ah, uh, of Elmenham. He was King Edmund's council before the invasions. And like it or not, he's the last Saxon noble with any sway. Why not crown a Dane instead? Half done, Jarl made it clear. He wants a Saxon king married to a Dane for a greater show of unity. But Oswald's not the sort of man you'd chase into battle with a grin. He's soft. And the settled Danes don't trust him. <laughs> Where is he now? I'll get the measure of him, see what I can do. You just missed him. He's headed for Elmenham just now, pleading once again for peace. If you go by the north gates and along the road, you may catch him. All right, so let's go chase him down, I guess. East Anglia. Pardon me. Start it. Why do you have that symbol above your head? You weren't part of that fight. Alright, so we need to go find Oswald. About 170 meters away. Let me steal a horse and let's see if I can get us stuck on a rock. Nope, not that time. I don't know, they might have done a small patch to this game. I might have missed it. It seems like the horses definitely do handle better. Be my eyes soon. Oh, he's probably just in this group up front, huh? Yeah. They rushed in like wolves, killing and burning as they went. I oh, built bitch. myself a home here. Ruid's clan attacked us as well. Oh, how nice to have a home to speak of, man. Mine was burned to the ground years ago. And by home, I wonder. Please, all of you, be we Dane or Saxon, we all want the same peace. With land to till and home to keep. Without fear of Ruid's violence. Till they break the peace with another bleeding raid. Nonsense. Their homes are here now. Same as ours, our futures run together, not apart. So what are these Danes attacking us, eh? What will you do about them? When I am king... <laughs> when I am your king, I'll set things right. You will be king when I am a flying troll. Doesn't have much of a support system, huh? I am Eivor of the Raven Clan. Are you Oswald? I am. 
You're not here to kill me, are you? I am not in the habit of killing kings, but I do like meeting them. I am Oswald, yes. For as long as I can hold out. So what happened here, Oswald? A clan led by a Dane called Ruid attacked this morning. Same. They've been sacking farms and hamlets across East Anglia for some time now, growing more brazen by the day. Do they know this is Helfden's land? They must. They just don't care. Their chaos has touched my home as well, and I am here to see that it does not happen again. Lately I've come to learn you are the hook that all hopes hang upon. As king, you could unite all Saxons and friendly Danes. A minor weight to bear, isn't it? Who else if not a king should bear it? Travel with me, Eivor. We can discuss my tenuous future on the road home. What begs your attention in Elmenham? Wedding preparations. Elmham is on guard as we ready my marriage to the Dane woman Valdis. She's a cousin of Hafton's. Good. A well-matched marriage can forge a strong alliance. So what's the hold-up? The hold-up? I don't yet have permission to marry Valdis. Her brothers don't approve of me. Why? Maybe you should work on trying to get some approval. If that's like the one thing that's standing between him and being a king. You know, this guy for asking me to follow him. Something is not quite like he's right not here. very uh Hold! There is smoke ahead. That's beat me. Attacking the walls of Norwich. Stay right. here. Fuck it. I'll have a look. I say he's not very talkative for uh for asking us to come along so he can tell us about his story. Ow, bitch. Together, all right? There we go. Okay, I've got him on some poison damage now. There we go. That does extra damage. Okay. This, uh, the poison is definitely going to be, uh, something I'll need to use a lot during boss fights, just because it generates that extra, that extra damage. I mean, there's no reason to not. What? How did that not count as a block? Get him from behind, bitch. Yo! Oh, he's not here. Okay, next guy. I don't like that we're fighting in a bush. Can we, like, move out of here, please? He's dead. dead. He's dead. Oh, you dodging bitch. Where are the... Come fight me, bitch. Come here. Come here. Seriously, where the fuck are you going? Get back here so I can just kill you. Look at that one combo, fucking dip. Alright, one more guy. One more guy, I think. You lose now! That should be the last of these pig-faced cowards. Oswald will be relieved to know of this. Well, we'll go ahead and return to Oswald for the beginning of the next episode. How's that sound? So thank you so much for watching. Have a great day, everybody. I'll see you all next time.